The sneakers that we're talking about today are quite possibly the best sneakers all of this year that you can find for under retail. And these are probably some of the best deals you will see. Always remember you guys, take care of yourself, take care of each other, tell somebody you love them today like I love you guys. And always remember, no matter what you guys are going through, at the end of the day, the day is going to end. Let's go ahead, let's get into this video. Yeah, yeah, he got kicks. I like switch. I, like I don't miss. Don't do bricks. Don't do bricks. He got kicks. The kid is sick. The kid is sick. Team with raw rock, rock. Cause he got hits. He got hits. What is up YouTube? I'm He Got Kicks. Welcome to my channel. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, ring that bell that we get all the notifications every time I drop on these bangers for you guys. Hit the like button, hit the share button, do all those great things for me. Follow me on Instagram at the real He Got Kicks and of course the hat page Perfect Brims and TikTok He Got Kicks 95. Shout out to today's commenters, man. Appreciate you guys engaging with the content, being positive with the content, and of course, making this a safe place for sneakerheads to come talk and just chill. But you guys, today's video, what we are talking about, of course, is five sneakers that I picked out that were released in the year 2024 that are under retail and I think are probably the best deals for anybody that is looking to get some really good shoes at a really good price. So these five sneakers we're gonna talk about today, I'll probably expand this list probably the end of December so we can do a top 10 list, but this right here, the top five best sneakers under retail you guys will be able to find. And I think these are some great shoes. Again, let me know in the comment section down below your list. What would you guys go with? And what are some of your favorite sneakers this year? I'm really, really curious. But again, we're gonna start this list off, you know, a little light, you know, talk about a sneaker that of course we all love and one that still is sick sitting in retail, but it is going for a very, very low price. And of course, that is the Air Jordan 6 Olympic. If you look at it, that is a great sneaker, something that we all, I think, love and pretty sure we all loved. But it is a sneaker that is going for well, well, well under retail. You're looking at a size 10 right now is at 150, 25% under retail. That is extremely cheap. That is a good price to grab it at. Instead of grabbing it at retail, go ahead, grab it, you know, again, for that 150 after fees and everything will still be under that retail price. So you cannot really beat that. Now, if you do have coupons or anything like that, go ahead, grab it from a store because you'll still have it for that under retail price. The next one, I'm, I promise, this is probably one of my favorite sneakers to release all this year. I love this shoe so much. That is, of course, the Air Jordan 1 Low Mocha. That sneaker is insane to me. I absolutely love that sneaker. You put sail laces in it, it looks even better. But this sneaker is a great one. Even though it's just recently released, you can still find it in stores, but 100% it is a good shoe. Just sitting under retail, I think the lowest ask for a size 10 is 124. And again, still a great sneaker, but it's just one of those that it is a low top. It's under retail, but I think that all in all, this is a good shoe. Something that I know a lot of us like, and of course, a lot of us that like the highs don't want to spend the money on the highs if you don't have them. You can get the lows and it'll be just as good. So I think this is a good shoe. One that I think a lot of people are going to enjoy. Another one, of course, is the Air Jordan 3, a mom in year while you were sleeping. Size 11 and a half women's, 10 men's is sitting at $190. Basically, all these are under retail. It doesn't matter what size, you can probably get them for a really, really good price. And again, a lot of resellers are probably sitting on some. So if you can grab a couple pairs off of them, for the low, you might as well do that because again, I think this is a great sneaker, great quality shoes, everything. I think all in all, these are really, really good sneakers. But at the end of the day, you know, they don't want to sit on sneakers like that. They don't want to not sell them, not move them, whatever. They probably took, made a mistake, bought them at retail. They'll lose a couple of dollars, but I know for a fact, if you get them, you know, if somebody actually offers them something, I'm sure they'll probably take it. Uh, but another one is another Amon Minier, a sneaker that I know a lot of us was looking forward to and ended up picking up, but it ended up sitting. And that is the Air Jordan 4 Amon Minier while you were sleeping in the Fossil colorway. I think it's a dope sneaker. I loved the shoe personally. I was kind of shocked that they actually sat like that. Uh, but again, at the end of the day, Amon Minier, they just need to probably go back to the drawing board just a little bit. And it's just one of those things, you know, it probably released at the wrong time. A lot of things can go into that. And that's, you know, just how it is, honestly. That's, I just think that all in all, it's a good shoe. I'm glad I picked it up, but 
again it's another sneaker that is just under retail that you guys should be able to pick up now again i haven't seen them in that many resale spots yet even requests up here in alabama they didn't have a pair and i was just was a little surprised at that so but again i think the amami air air jordan 4 is a great shoe i think it's something that again a lot of people like but probably released at the wrong time because we have so much stuff coming out over the next month so i know a lot of people are just saving their money for that because they'd much rather have those another one is the air jordan one low howard university i love this shoe personally i absolutely love it i think it looks great with the white laces in it i think it looks really good especially if you're an atlanta braves fan new england patriot fan a lot of different fans you can grab it i grabbed two of them i think all in all this is a really really good shoe but i am aware that again you can find these everywhere you can go to whatever retail store it is anything you can grab a pair for retail but if you have coupons if you go to hibbit your city gears use your reward points whatever you can get them for well under retail anyways but i think all in all these are really really good shoes i think that they are great they might have sold better honestly if they would have actually had all their pairs in whenever the release day was so i think there's a lot of things that kind of went against this shoe not all the pairs being here they only dropped less than ten thousand on the sneakers app there's a lot of things that was going against this shoe if we're being completely honest so i think all in all a great sneaker great shoe to wear great shoe to actually pick up i love low tops they're comfortable so all in all, I think any low top is probably really, really good to pick up. And, and that even goes with everything. I think the low top Jordan 4, the RMs, I think those are honestly more comfortable than the regular Jordan 4. So all in all, you guys, I think that you have a lot of good sneakers. I'll dive a lot deeper into it by the end of the year. And that way I can kind of bring a broader list to you guys. But these right here are just five sneakers that come off the top of my head that I know a lot of us liked. And of course, you may see other sneakers by the end of the year be under retail, like an Olive 9, a Black Toe 14. You may see some of that. So again, all in all, I think this is a solid list. Let me know what you guys would change or if you guys would change anything in the comment section down below. I appreciate you guys. I love you guys. Thank you guys for everything. It means more than me than you guys know. Love all the support. We got a lot of things going, man. I got to get into the short grind as well. I need to start doing more shorts for you guys and showing you guys that and everything. So again, man, every like, every comment, everything. I appreciate you guys more than you guys know. Got to just get out of the, you know, my comfort zone of just doing the long form content and got to do the short form sometimes too. So I appreciate you guys. I love you guys. And again, as always, stay safe. Take care of yourself. Take care of each other. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.